Hello everyone, today we have a 2020 BMW Z4 S Drive 30i. It's rear wheel drive and a twin turbo BMW engine. And that is running as smooth as could be. So I'm going to go ahead and close this up and take you for a tour. Okay, you see that it does have LED headlights around. And if any of these LEDs appear to flicker at all, that is the refresh rate of the camera that does that. They don't flicker at all to the human eye. You see that it does have alloy wheels. Uh, come around here, you can see that it does have dual exhaust. Go ahead and give that a listen. They just sound beautiful. So I'm going to go ahead and open up the trunk. Okay. And this Z4 is actually on its way over to Blue Star. They're a third-party independent inspection company that will do an inspection on this. I'll go ahead and put it up in the air, take pictures of the undercarriage and such and give their opinion of the vehicle. So make sure that you watch out for the Blue Star report. See, it does have speakers behind the seats and a wind diffuser right there. And then you've got cream colored leather seats. I'm gonna go ahead and show you the VIN right here. That is 3021 for the last four digits. You do have two driver presets. And then we'll go ahead and hop in. Okay, and as you look down here, you'll see that it only has 6,177 miles on the vehicle. And then you have your cruise controls, your paddle shifters, your push to talk. And then we're just gonna go ahead and do a cold restart. So that you can experience that. There we go, and it is showing your navigation here by default. As we come over here, we have it up on settings right now. We can just jump to the map. And there's your map right there. And then we can also jump to media, of which your sources are AM, FM, Sirius, XM. And then as you come down here, you'll connect through Bluetooth to Spotify and such. And then you can jump to options, to communications, and then to navigation, to other connections such as weather, my BMW, and then the lap timer. Okay, and then if you want to see the backup camera, we'll go ahead and put it in reverse. There's your backup camera, and I am near walls, so those sensors are working correctly, and then it is alerting me that I am near a wall. So, go ahead and put that in park. Okay, and then as we come down here, you have your 12 volt power right here, wireless charging. Uh, and then you have your USB right here as well. And then you have your shifter, and then this is how I was controlling the infotainment. And then as you come down here, you've got Sport, Comfort, and Eco Pro and then your top. We'll go ahead and operate that so that you can see that. Then I also wanted to point out, as I point out things that I noticed, but this has some vandalism right here where it shows that somebody loves somebody else. I don't know what it says. So at any rate, uh, just so you're aware that that is there. Okay, and then we come up here. We'll go ahead and operate that roof. And just like that, that is complete. And I just wanted to give you a view of that once that's done. And then we'll go ahead and hop out. Once we take a look at the key fob, there's your key fob right there. Okay. And we'll go ahead and hop out. It does let you know when your doors are open, as you see there. Okay, so you see the top is in great condition, having been a convertible owner. That's one of the first things that I look at when purchasing a convertible. And then you'll also see it does have a real glass window. 
so there will be no fogging or anything like that effect that you're used to with convertibles with plastic rear windows. This particular vehicle does have a branded title. There was an impact here up front and center. The airbags did not deploy. There was no structural damage, so we got it all fixed up. It has passed the 150 point inspection and the state of Utah safety inspection. For more inventory, visit us at tjchapmanauto.com. In the spirit of full disclosure, here is a copy of the original label for your vehicle so you can see what it was equipped with straight out of the factory.